You are standing in a street where nobody seems to be in a hurry. Just a few passers-by are out strolling. Some are resting on benches. The light in the sky seems soft, very soft. The sun is shining softly and the wind is blowing so gently that it feels like the wind has given you the gift of a shawl. Feeling the gentle wind blow is like wearing a luxurious open weave shawl. It's like being able to be out in your pajamas and it's okay. It's the perfect temperature and you're wearing the perfect clothes. As your neck and shoulders relax, you look down. You are standing in a street made of dove gray stones. The stones are wide and nicely weathered. How many people have stopped here to rest and enjoy the soft light? It's like being among friends. You don't have to do anything. Just be. In the softly sunlit street where you're enjoying a moment just being and doing nothing at all, you notice something. You notice there's a beautiful work of art inlaid in the dove gray stones at your feet. It's made of bronze and pale blue paint. It looks familiar. There are several circles, one inside the other. One, two, three, four circles. There are points like petals or arrows in the beautiful artwork that's been set into the paving stones. You start counting the petals. One, two, three, four cardinal directions. North, south, east, west. Then there are others. Five, six, seven, eight ordinal directions, northeast, southeast, southwest, northwest, the in-between ones. The beautiful work of art inlaid in the street is a compass rose. There's something special about this compass rose. Each of its directions opens on to a different garden. And each one is a different place altogether. Each garden is beautiful in its own way, but each one is different from the last. And the next, and the next. It's an invitation to turn and savor the view. But as you turn, a strange thing happens. The landscape begins to dissolve around you.